Welcome to the AACS Daily News. Area residents took time over the weekend to remember military service members who are prisoners of war and those still missing in action. Friday, September 21st, is National POW MIA Recognition Day. The city of Attleboro held a formal ceremony on Saturday at the Veterans Memorial Triangle at Capron Park. Keynote speaker was past VFW Commander Paul Spera. And I will end this with a story that I have told many times. And it exemplifies the reason that we do this. There was a young man that was going to Iraq. He had joined the army, told his parents he wanted to do this. He wanted to do something for his country. He said goodbye to everyone and he went off to Iraq and he was killed in action. They returned his remains. They honored him. They buried him. And they mourned. And sometime after all of that period had passed, a package came. And in the package were all of his personal effects that they had gathered up in his living space in Iraq. And they put it all into a box and they shipped it home to his family. And they went through all of these effects. And one item that they found in there was an envelope addressed to his parents. And they opened it up. And in that envelope was his last will and testament. And in his last will and testament at not 20 years old, he wrote down that his brother could have his bicycle, his friends could have his hockey sticks, something for his sister, take care of my dog, all of the things that a 20 year old is going to write. And then he ended it. And he ended it with a reason that we are here tonight. And he said very simply, whatever happens, whichever way your lives go, I only have one request. Never forget me. No matter what, never forget me. Remember that I died doing something that I wanted to do. Remember that I died with men that I loved, trusted, and cherished. Remember that no matter what, I have always loved you and I always will. Never forget me. And that's why we do this, to live those words to never forget those on 9-11, to never forget those in Vietnam, Korea, wherever else in the world that there are missing in action, to never forget that these are not just numbers and statistics. They're not just names. They're fathers, brothers, sons, sisters, mothers. They're people. They're people with families, families that love them, families that miss them, families that have a hole, an emptiness in their lives because they never knew what happened. Never forget me. And tonight, by your presence here, you stamp that flag with your approval. The words on that flag are what brought you here tonight the words are, you are not forgotten. That's it for today's update. You can watch all of our content by visiting our website, doubleacs.com, by downloading the AACS mobile app, or by visiting the AACS Roku channel. For AACS News, I'm Austin Ricketts.